with the NBC News, Lord Darfur National Television, live with me, Jacob Barry. Breaking news from Darfur Television, live with me, Jacob Barry. Tawila Market in Darfur was closed amid the Jesuits' attempt to rob the shops of local residents. A woman and her children were tied up to the tree in Tawila, and other women were raped in the locality of Shangla, Dubai, which is in Darfur. More than 27,000 people displaced due to the attacks in Darfur's capital, Al Fashir. More than two people were killed and hundreds injured amid the fighting in Darfur's eastern region. Less than 48 hours after meeting for talks in Asibia, South Sudanese leaders of both sides failed to abide with the ceasefire agreement that they are signatory to, and each side accuses other of breaching an agreement. The president of Nigeria, good luck Jenison for weeks, refused for an aid that was aiming to assist his military might to search for 300 kidnapped girls. Addressing the nation through her weekly presidential radio and internet talk show, and in the eve of Mother's Day, the First Lady Michelle Obama said, Like millions of people around the world, she and her husband are outraged and heartbroken over the abduction of Nigerian girls since April 15. Thank you for watching Darfur Television. Stick around for more to come.